Disability Society, a nonprofit organization that helps people with disabilities, was joined by Mayor Colin Bazran outside of City Hall to talk about the importance of diversity in the community and to mark October as Community Inclusion Month. City Council has made it a priority to uh, make diversity and inclusion um, one of the most important uh, priorities of our term on Council and it's something that regardless of who's in those chairs uh, next term should carry it on uh, because everybody in our community should be able to find their place and feel like uh, Kelowna is home. The Pathways Ability Society in Kelowna brought everyone together to create what they're calling the inclusion chain which symbolizes the importance of including everyone no matter their abilities. And the idea of the, of the event is really to showcase the diversity of our community and, and, and celebrate that diversity and the idea of inclusion. Every individual matters and we want to make that point by holding this inclusion chain event. The, the point isn't so much the number of people, it's the diversity of people. You see people of all ethnicities, people of all abilities, people of all genders, you see everybody represented here and it's, it's, it's that. It's seeing what a community really looks like. That's really the message we're trying to deliver here. Pathways Kelowna says it's very important to have Kelowna's support in marking October as Community Inclusion Month, but they know there is more work left to be done. I think we've come a long way, but I think that, that we've got so much further to go. And that's why, again, we run an event like this, because you never want to take your foot off the throttle or foot off the pedal. You want to keep reminding the community that every day we need to be hiring people uh, with diverse abilities. We need to be making contingencies and, and, and understanding the needs of all people in the community, regardless of abilities and things like that. Pathways Kelowna is very excited about their next big project, which will be building 68 affordable housing units for people with disabilities downtown. I'm Brayden Ursel in Kelowna for Castanet.